If you, like me, suddenly find yourself locked down at home, I think that God has given us a really significant opportunity to learn something fundamental that will serve us for years to come. When he created the world, he didn't create Adam, humankind, until the sixth day. It's the last thing he did. And if you look at it from Adam's perspective, the seventh day, the first day of Adam's life, God decreed was a day when he would rest. And so for Adam, the first day of his life was rest. And only after he had rested did God put him to work, fulfilling the mission that God had given him to subdue the world. We so often get that the wrong way around, especially those of us in Christian ministry. We are always so busy and we work and we work and we work and then we tumble into rest to recover. But God is saying to us, it should be the other way around. We minister out of rest. First we rest, and that doesn't mean just lying around doing nothing. It means burrowing deep into God and into his grace and into his love and really knowing him and spending time with him, laying everything else aside, and only then do we work. When we seek God's kingdom first, everything else falls into place. We are so much more effective. And if you're like me, you know that in theory, you agree with it, but in practice, the way we've lived our lives shows that actually we don't really believe it in our hearts. And I think this is a God-given opportunity for us to get that right. I mean, our society is so anxious anyway, but right now anxiety levels are through the roof. And for me, every morning, I find it really helps just to focus on Jesus, to rest in him and to obey Paul's command to cast all my anxiety onto him. And what that looks like for me is just reminding myself that God is in control, that nothing, not even a virus, can separate me from the love of God, that I'm safe in his hands. And then I just offer myself up to him. And I pray blessing on you uh, as you do the same in this time. May you learn what it is to minister out of genuine rest. It will serve you uh, for the rest of your life.